how to solve x plus 2 x plus 3 x plus 4 x plus 5 over x minus 2 x minus 3 x minus 4 x minus 5 is equal to 1 we'll find out what is the value of x here is x is a real number so let's start first of all i can say here is x plus 2 times here is x plus 5 bracket and here is x plus 3 and here is x plus 4 this x plus 4 bracket over in this case same case i can say x minus 2 times x minus 5 bracket and here is x minus 3 times x minus 4 is equal to 1 i just change the place then I can say it will be look x times x it will be x square x times 5 it will be 5x here is 2 times x it will be twice x plus 2 times 5 it will be 10 break head and in this case I can say x times x it will be x square plus it will be 4x plus it will be 3x plus it will be 3 times 4 12 o bar and in this case i can say here is x square and here is minus 5x and this is minus 2x because of that plus minus it will be minus 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 it will be plus 2 times 5 it will be 10 bracket and in this case i can say again x square minus x times 4 it will be 4x and x 3 times x it will be minus 3x and 4 times 3 it will be plus 12 because of that minus minus it will be plus is equal to 1 then I can say here is look x square and 5x plus 2x it will be 7x and here is plus 10 in this case I can say easily x square plus 7x plus 12 and here is x square minus 7x plus 10 and in this case x square minus 7x plus 12 is equal to 1 then I can say here is let so let x square plus 7x plus 10 is equal to p and in this case i can say x square minus 7x plus 10 is equal to q so if i put the value of p and q so i can say it will be look it is p so p times and we know that x square plus 7x plus 10 it will be p so i can say p but here is more is 2 so i can say plus 2 and in this case i can say q times q plus because of that it is 12 but here is 10 so it will be 2 is equal to 1 then I can say here is 1 so 1 times it will be p square plus 2p is equal to this times this so it will be q times q it will be q square and q times 2 it will be 2q then this equation becomes I can see easily p square and this q square this is plus when it is move on in this side we are find out minus q square and it will be plus 2p but it will be minus 2q is equal to 0 then we know that a square minus b square it will be a plus p times a minus p according to these rules i can say here is p plus q times p minus q plus here is 2 is common so 2 here is p minus q is equal to 0 then i can say easily here is p minus q is common so uh, this uh, divide this it will be p plus q and this uh, divide this it will be plus 2 is equal to 0 so we'll find out here is two case our first case is p minus q is equal to 0 and other case i can say easily p plus q plus 2 is equal to 0 then i can say here is p is equal to q 
now remember that p is x square plus 7x plus 10 and q is x square minus 7x plus 10 so i can say easily here is so you know that p is x square plus 7x plus 10 and q is x square minus 7x plus 10 so in this case p and q are equal so i can say easily here is x square plus 7x plus 10 is equal to x square minus 7x plus 10 then in this case i can say x square x square cancel 10 10 cancel so we are find out here is 7x and it, when it is move on in this side we are find out positive 7x is equal to 0 then i can say here is 14x is equal to 0 then if i divide both side protein so i can see easily x is equal to 0 so we we'll find out the value of x is equal to 0 and other case we we'll find out here is p plus q plus 2 is equal to 0 but remember that p is x square plus 7x plus 10 plus q is x square minus 7x plus 10 and here is plus 2 is equal to 0 now i can say here is easily x squared plus x squared it will be 2x squared and here is 7x 7x cancel so it will be 20 20 plus 2 it will be 22 is equal to 0 then i can say it will be 2x squared is equal to minus 22 then i divide both side 2 so i can say 2 to cancel and 22 divide 2 it will be 11 so we we'll find out the value of x square is equal to minus 11 then i can say easily x square is equal to minus 11 i use both side square root then it will be x is equal to plus minus square root 11 minus it will be i square so i can see easily x is equal to plus minus square root 11 i so it is a imaginary number it is not real number but we are need the real number because of that we know that x member of r so we are find out the value of x is equal to 0 this is our correct answer let prove our equation is x plus 2 x plus 3 x plus 4 x plus 5 over x minus 2 x minus 3 x minus 4 x minus 5 is equal to 1 so we we'll find out the value of x is equal to 0 so i can see the 0 plus 2 it will be 2 times 0 plus 3 it will be 3 times 0 plus 4 it will be 4 and it this is 5 over it will be minus 2 times minus 3 times minus 4 times minus 5 then i can see easily it will be look uh, here is 1 times 2 times 3 times 4 times 5 and here is minus 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 so here is 4 minus so it will be plus so i can see it will be also 1 times 2 times 3 times 4 times 5 then i can see it will be 5 factorial over 5 factorial so this this cancel so we are find out here is 1 so left hand side is equal to right hand side so i can see easily x is equal to 0 is our right answer